Welcome back everybody, Pat here from Hot Wheels Hunter Akron. Take a look at some cars here in my display. You know, something pretty cool. I got this curio cabinet for just $20. Yeah, at uh, the attic, collectibles and more in Barberton. I said, man, you know, I got all these loose Hot Wheels. Gosh, I need somewhere to display them. So I picked up this thing. It's about, oh, six and a half feet tall. It's got two lights built in it. Mirrored back, the sides are clear. Door opens on this side. This is a door, yeah. but uh, I got some some of the loose ones in here. I still got a whole nother. Well, that uh, that shelf unit that I built from a from like a quarter pallet at work. I tore it apart and built a shelf unit out of it. And it's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's a, uh, it's hanging right over here, and it's a, uh, it's full. Yep, yeah, that is full. Got a little space right there. I <laughs> uh, got Camaros going in there. Yeah. So, but uh, anyway, do a little. Looking at some cars. You know these things, right? Sure you do. Wild Thing by Larry Wood. Yeah. Um, one of these is actually very special. Let me put my glasses on. We both have opening hoods. This one is signed by Larry Wood. Uh, I believe it's a signature series because I know have another car that's also signed by him. That's uh, his initials, LRW. It says right there on the fender, Larry Wood. Let me get a good look at that. Yeah, that is wild thing. Very nice. So I went out yesterday, and uh, the Family Dollar in Kenmore on Kenmore Boulevard here in Akron has a shipper, a PK shipper. So I started going through it, you know, and I see the uh, the Mazda. Whoa, way too big. There we go. The Mazda Miata in silver. I see the Toyota Land Cruiser 80 in gray. These are all P case. Yeah. And I picked up some uh, 64 Nova gassers, the wagons. I love the racing livery and I love gassers, you know, of course. So, uh, P case again. I got like three of them. Because I had a bunch. And then lo and behold, I come across another Ford Galaxy treasure hunt. How about that? That is nice. Indeed, that is nice. Um... Chris Carmichael, yeah, I got your message, your comment. Um, I do collect Corvettes and uh, Camaros and Porsches. I bought this one today. I already have it on card, but I bought it just because I wanted to open it and put it with my loose ones, you know, and grow that collection of loose ones, not to mention the ones I have carded on the wall that will stay carded on the wall. <laughs> 
Um, I was somewhere, I don't know, shoot, where was I, Dollar Generals, and I found another treasure hunt of the Custom 77 Dodge van. This is the Jack of Hearts. Uh, the symbol's right there in his axe or whatever he's holding. It's a, it's a really cool car, really cool van. Uh, so, that's extra. I've got several of those now. Um, the Big Air Bear Lair. Yeah, you've seen that I uh, customized one last night, right? I'll show it to you here. Put it back in the package, but I put bigger wheels on it. Did all the, the silver work, you know, because everything was just black. And now you can see the shocks behind the wheel there. Uh, same in the back, if you actually could see, there's a peak. Yeah, they're painted as well. Um, the gas can sticking out of the trunk there. The lights. The front end. Look, the front end even looks like the front end on the card. And you know what? I wasn't even going for that. I didn't even reference the card when I painted the, the front end. I just painted it. <laughs> but it's ironic that it matches, huh? Look at that. That matches pretty darn well. Pretty darn well, I must say. Those lights on top look fabulous. The front, you know, I wish I could have put the black in between like they have on the card. But I'm not that talented. I don't have a, a brush that small. And believe it or not, guys, I don't even have a paintbrush. <laughs> I did the paint with a toothpick, okay? Yes, a toothpick. So here's a regular one, and then here's mine. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. <laughs> okay, so wife and I went out today. Found a couple 2022s. Yeah, a couple. This one here is Roadster Bite. That's new for 2022. You can see the card art is much larger than one of previous years. And then I got Bubble Matic. Yeah. And he is also new for 2022. Yep. So I've offered these to somebody. Um, also, if you guys need anything from H Case, man, I got three of them sitting at work and they're just sitting in the back. They're not even out for anybody to, to get. But uh, if you need anything from the H case, let me know. Um, it's got the things like the Toyota Celica. It's got, I think, some more Bel Airs. It's got the Lotrucka, the black one. It's got um, the Datsun 510, I believe, is still in there. Um, it's got, what else? Uh, the Mercedes, the black SEL. Um, it's got a couple of Pontiac GTOs, the uh, newer ones. It's got the wheelie bars on the back of it. Gold and blue, I think, were the colors. Um, it's got the Audi, um, the station wagon, the Avant. It's got that. Uh, it's got a lot of nice cars, so if there's anything that you guys need from the H case, let me know. Came across more flying customs I needed at Target today. Boulevard Bruiser. That is a great rendition of Boulevard Bu Bruiser. Is it not? That is fabulous. I needed this Mustang. I had it at five below the other day, but they wanted three bucks for it. Nah. I paid a dollar forty-nine. This is going to complete the collection, the series of the Flying Customs. This 96 Nissan 180SX Type X. A hard one to find. There's the cars needed. I have the Torino. I have the Caddy. I have the Vega. Now I have the Mustang. Now I have the Nissan and the Boulevard Bruiser. I need the Mini Cooper Challenge and the Chevy C10. So not bad. I only need two to complete it. Not bad. Don't know if you guys got to see it, but I love the Bone Shaker. Here's the Baja Bone Shaker. 
pretty nice pretty nice he'd look good right next to that uh big air bell there wouldn't he <laughs> what'd i do with that let's see oh yeah let's go let's go to the dunes <laughs> let's go four by and that'd be awesome huh yep that is pretty cool i bought a you know the monster truck of the uh, bone shaker I bought it just because it came with another bone shaker. <laughs> bought another bus just to open up and put with my other buses. Bought another truck just to, uh, I don't know, just to display elsewhere. Maybe open and put with my other loose trucks. Not sure. Um, yeah, but I had to get that. Um... This is from Trucks of Matchbox Truck Series. It's the only one they had at Walmart, and uh, I was in a Stowe. Yeah, Stowe Walmart. I think that's Stowe. <laughs> anyway, uh, found this, and they got several of them. You know, and I went to Target looking specifically for that Gas Monkey Garage Corvette. Of course, it's all gone, you know, and there was at least 10 of them the other day. <clears throat> this is a nice find. You guys know what it is? That front end should give it away. What is it? What is it? I like this card, how it's got a see-through back panel. Back pane, isn't that nice? Any guesses? Custom Rotter. It's by Hot Wheels. Limited to 15,000 pieces. 64 Buick Riviera, number two of four. Isn't that a beauty? And you would think it was Johnny Lightning, right? And then here's the other cars, I guess. Oh. Let's see if I can.